Alrighty, this is the design that I've made that's built around a specific kit that includes a lot of the parts that I'll need. Today I'm just going to be making this single part. It's got two 90 degree bends in it. It's pretty simple and it should be good. I've got everything measured out and I'm marking it on the steel so that I know where to put my clamp blocks and where to bend. Just cutting off the excess material here. And bringing the bender over and getting it set up. This is a Rogue Fab M600 series bender. Great machine. It's definitely taking some getting used to learning how to use, but it's definitely effective and helpful. Switching over the spacers from one of my other dies, they started making these super handy spacers so that you don't have to finagle holding up the 20 pound die and five spacers on either side. Spacers are nice and easier to use than washers. And first bend, this is a 90 degree bend. Only takes a couple minutes and the result is definitely worth it. measuring spring back to make sure I get perfect 90 degrees. I think I had to overbend by 4 degrees, so I ended up bending to a total 94 degrees, but it makes a nice solid 90 degrees. Oh yeah! Right on. And setting up bend number two, Rogue Fab also has this super nice angle cube that you see on the end to make sure that the uh, bends are lined up and they're not all wobbly. This one I overbent by just a hair, but it should come out fine as, as soon as I weld together all the other supports. It is off by about one degree. Great finishing product. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.